surprise to see me. <laughs> hey, Crafterbellas. It is part three of the ridiculousness that is my life, aka shopping. I think there's going to be like a lady who was on like Dateline or something like that last night who buys way too much stuff. And I was like, oh my God, that's me. Anyway, so, but it's all relatively inexpensive. So go figure, Tigger. Okay, so, e. So went to Tuesday morning after Kate posted that lovely enabling video <laughs> about stuff that they had at Tuesday morning. And I kind of have a crappy Tuesday morning. Like it's, it's not even like it's an underground store. Like you park and you have to walk in a door and you go downstairs and it's all underground. So kind of shady, but they have a really small scrapbook section. San Francisco is weird. They don't want any of those things. Like we don't have Target in San Francisco. Like the Target is in a little city called Daily City right outside of San Francisco. <laughs> so it's kind of ridiculous. Um, but surprisingly, they actually had some stuff. I guess people hadn't, maybe they don't know that there's Tuesday morning there. So I picked up a few things. Um, I picked up this McGill punch and I'm kind of on the hunt. I guess there's one that's a Polaroid picture. Polaroid, like the frame. And I'd really like that one. So if any of you guys find it out there, let me know and I shall pay you. But I picked up the mini library pocket and you probably can't see. That's what it looks like right there. Um, and it's not huge. It's folded. It's one and three eighths by one and three eighths. But so, you know, it'd be cute on a layout to put like a tag in or something like that. So I got that and um, then I got the mini folder one, which I thought was really cute right there and folded. This is also it's one and seven eighths by one and three sixteenths. So um, obviously not huge. Sorry, I'm hearing dogs bark. Um, not huge, but definitely um, layout appropriate. It may be even small enough where you could put it on a card. There's a dog major barking. <laughs> okay, so the good things that everybody was running to Tuesday morning for. The bits. These things are like four or five bucks. So for the fact that they had them for 150 was great. So I got this set and I opened it and it's actually like, um, it's all birthday related, which is great. Celebrate balloons and it's the really it's the nice long ones so you can tuck them under things and then I got the chaps bits <sighs> sorry to go check in on what the dog barking was um and so then I got these tags as well I got two of those I think Oh wait, that's the scrapbook.com order. Um, yeah, I got two of those. And I got these ones. These were from their love collection from last year. Their Valentine's Day one. Which I just found that I had a few papers for. Oh, there's my taxes. <laughs> um, and I did get a couple of the stamp sets. I got the courtyard. And these were all $1.99. And these, again, are like six bucks. The trailer. Sorry, I should have pulled these out before. Oh, those are the other chaps. Um, and I got. I know I did. I got the birthday one somewhere. I don't know where it is right now, but I did get the little donkey birthday pinata. Oh, here. Donkey, <laughs> the party animal. Really, really cute. Um, and that was it from Tuesday morning. Um, and my last was from scrapbook.com. Um, I just, was fishing on there one night and I thought, oh, I'll pick up a couple things. As you know, Sassafras is now no longer its own company. It's partnering up with people, doing all kinds of stuff, and lots of places are not getting rid of it. 
like they should at like deep discount but this I think was like 30 cents and it's just a big label sheet Um, and then I picked up some Emma Shop border stickers. I love that collection. I really, Emma Shop is great. And I picked up these stamps from Kaiser Craft, and I just thought they're Christmas, but I thought, like, that tree is really cute. You could totally paper piece that tree, um, or just have, like, different patterns, different colors. So that was cool. It's called The Silly Season. Then I picked up these Dreaming Remarks. They are the fabric stickers from Amy Tangerine. I thought those were cute. And I like this, A Slice of the Good Life. And then I picked up a Craft Fun Day 6x6 pad by My Mind's Eye. Um, I picked up this alphabet stamp set from Pebbles, and I really, really like this because most of the time when you get a stamp set um, that's alphas, you get one letter. So you got to like do the two, you know, do the letters up to where the second letter is, and either you have to um, stamp them a jig or just really hope that you get it straight. Well, this one comes with two of every letter, and I'm talking even the Q's, even the V's, even the X's and the Z's. It all comes um, with two. And I think that this part is part of their fresh goods because if you see the flowers at the bottom, there are flowers like that in that paper collection. So, and this was, I think, really cheap. Um, and then last but not least, definitely, at least, least for a while, um, so I say, right, I, I ordered another Studio Calico clear stamp set. And this has the banners. Really, really cute. It says, oh me, oh my. So that is it. Those are my hauls. I will talk to all of you ladies very, very soon. And Project Life stuff coming up. Yay. Talk to you later. Bye.